Just like Prince Albert. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> Hello friends, welcome to part two of the Mandela Effect video. Let's get just right into it. Let's dive in. <laughs> Famous, famous, famous line from Forrest Gump. Life is like a box of chocolates. You never know what you want to get. Life is, is like, like a box of chocolates. Yeah. It's and always has been. Life uh, was like a box of chocolates. You know that you say that. I reflect back on the movie and like what portion of the movie that's actually in, and it kind of, that makes sense because he's reflecting on his life. Mm -hmm. But at the same time, nobody says it like that. Tom Life's Hanks like, oh, filmed a kind of parody trailer to it. Tom Hanks, the guy who played Forrest Gump, yeah, and he says life is like a box of chocolates. Classic pickles. Don't know it. Is it the one with the? It has bird. Like a bird, yes. Yeah, okay. So everybody remembers it. V L A S S I C. It's actually just one S. Um, that one, I'm not really sure. I do remember it being hmm. Vlasic with two S's because it's based off of classic famous line from Toy Story. Woody says, Have you seen Toy Story? Yeah, but like, there's all a, the Disney people are just cringing. There's a. There's a. Snake in my boot. Oh, yeah, okay. Okay, yeah, that makes sense. Snake, yeah. one snake, snake in one of in my boots. boots. Yeah. It's actually, there's a snake in my boots. His boots. Boots. How is that even possible? A <laughs> snake in my boots. It's just like dangling in both. No, that one's stupid. Is it a slinky snake? Like a dog? That's another one that I just can't. Like people are like, well, it makes sense. And I'm like, no, it does not not. Next one. Hot sauce. Rooster on in front. It's red, green lid. Tabasco. Try one more time. It's new. It's Asian. Oh, sriracha. Sriracha. I don't know how it's right. Wrong. Sriracha. Sri There's an R in it. Shri sriracha. 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 In the commercials. Sriracha. 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 Fruit of the looms, like the underwear. Okay. Okay. The logo is fruit in a cornucopia. Okay. Right? Yeah, I'm feeling, I'm just gonna say grapes. But it, there is a cornucopia. Yeah. For sure a cornucopia. Yeah, or just grapes by itself. It's like grapes and apples and oranges, bananas, but no not, cornucopia. No thingy. And the Hunger Games came out. <laughs> yeah. You and about. they said the cornucopia is like the middle area. I was like, oh, cornucopia, like Fruit of the Looms, but Fruit of the Looms doesn't have a cornucopia. Balance of the Lambs. Famous line. Clarice. Hello, Clarice. Yeah. Right? Again, Clarice. I think I've said this like a hundred times in this video. Hello, that is on like shirts and stuff. Yeah, yeah you follow means. He never says hello, Clarice. He actually apparently never says her name even. No. He, like, he doesn't just say Clarice instead of hello Clarice. He never right. even says that in that tone, which, again, <laughs> no. <laughs> my brain, my brain. Looney Tunes. Yeah. Looney? Looney, L-O-O. -O. N-E-Y. Tunes. T-O-O. Yeah. T-O-O, because they're cartoons. Yeah. Right? Looney cartoons. Looney False. Tunes. It's tunes like tunes, T-U-N-E-S. Uh, Do they sing? Are they musical? <laughs> Santa Claus. Okay. Spell it. No, Jen. Now I just I feel like I get pressured <laughs> by the camera <laughs> <laughs> to spell probably. T A. Yes. C L A U S. Claus. Claus. Okay. You spelled it the right way. Quote, new way. A lot of people remembering it having an E at the end. Okay. Yeah. Personally, I don't That's just because really I'm a bad speller. It's not because I remembered fair. it the That's right fair. way. Personally, I don't really know, but if you look at claws with an E and claws without an E, the claws without an E totally looks weird. Also, my mom was literally obsessed with the movie Santa Claus. Still mm. is. I buy her a Santa Claus movie like every Christmas because she loves them. And I swear it had an E on that movie. So maybe mm. it does on the movie, but not in like real life, which makes no sense. But... Okay, when you're young, you play with these blocks. They're huge blocks, like building blocks. They like give them Lego? to kids. 
bigger Lego. It's literally the Building bigger blocks? version. Lego. They're called Mega Blocks. Mega Blocks. You know, spelled Mega Blocks, B L O C K S. Because they're a kid's toy, why would you want or to give it? a kid something that's spelled wrong? It's actually just B L O K S. We're saying, so I hope you know this one. Do, re, mi, fa, li, da. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, I remember all that. Okay, you might not know this one then. Basically, okay. it's do re mi fa so is what everybody remembers. Turns out it's actually soul, which I feel like I do maybe vaguely remember, but the part about it that doesn't make sense is it's so Anita pulling thread, which why would it be soul Anita pulling thread? That doesn't really make sense. Mm. And Do I, re mi fa sol la ti do. Yeah, God, but it's I haven't sol, done that in ages. Sol la. It doesn't. It that doesn't make sense either. Okay, let's go back for a second there. Mm -hmm. Literally, the only one in there that's a three-letter word. That too. That too. So do re mi fa, and then sol la, la ti do. do again. False. Home Depot. You know the place. Is actually the Home Depot. A bunch of people don't remember it having the. I'm not really sure because I know for a one billion percent fact I used to go to Home Depot with my dad a lot. We never said we're going to the Home Depot. It was always we're going to Home, Home Depot. Depot. So it's possible again that people just don't say the full name of it. Mm. But we're lazy. Thinker statue. Yeah. Chin. Uh, a lot of people remember it being um, on his face. Yeah, that's. Like, I was very. It's like on his forehead. Oh yeah, forehead one. Yeah, he's like thinking, and, and um, it's actually chin. So you were right. I went for this first. I was trying to figure of, out which yeah. one it was, but I, I don't know why I landed up there. Yeah, it's because my brain was trying to figure out. Subconscious. So it is actually chin, which does look a little weird, but also um, T bow in football. Don't ask me what team. I don't know nothing. Mm -hmm. He did like the Tebow pose, which was imitating the thinker statue, and he put his hand on his forehead, right. so a lot of people were like, why would he imitate a statue wrong? So, but it is Chin, you were right. Lucy, um, uh, I, oh, love, I Lucy. love Lucy, yeah. really famous line from I Love Lucy. I don't know. You got some splaining to do. Okay, yeah. A I lot of that. people say that. Again, it's a movie one. I feel like all the movie ones are like on t-shirts and stuff. Mm -hmm. He actually just never says that. Which, the fact that I you didn't know what I was talking about, and then I said you got some explaining to do, and then you knew what I was talking yeah, about, that never happened, to... never. Which blows a lot of people's minds as well. Like Risky business. Okay. Okay. Do you know? Do you know the movie? No. With um. Why well, can't I think of his name? Tom Cruise. I was thinking about the things. <laughs> Tom Cruise Cruz slides out into the hallway. You'll know this because okay, of all the yeah, yeah. Halloween costumes. He's wearing like a really oversized shirt, yeah, socks, sunglasses. Shirt. Yeah, and boxers. Mm hmm. Shoes. Not boxers. wearing sunglasses. Not wearing sunglasses. This one, personally, again, no. I've never actually seen it, so I don't know. I'm pretty sure the Halloween costumes have sunglasses. Exactly, included. that's exactly it. If you buy a Halloween costume in a Halloween store, they all include just like plain black sunglasses. Mm. Tom Cruise literally did an interview where he talked about the sunglasses falling off, but that never even happened. There was no sunglasses in the, in the movie at all. It would, I feel like he's holding them. Yeah. Like he's sliding in, you know? Mm -hmm. No, never happened. Next one. Reindeer names. Oh, Not going to make you name them all. Thank you, Lord. <laughs> <laughs> the last two in the song, Donner and Blitzen. So, yeah. Okay, it's never been, never has been, never will be. Donner, it's always been Donder. 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 Donder and Blitzen. People awesome. just over top of words, I think. Yeah, they do. They're just like, duh, duh. Yeah. Misheard lyrics? I'll do the video. Misheard lyrics. We need to do that. Yeah. thing is Coke Zero. My dad used to drink a lot of Coke Zero. Everybody remembers it being called Coke Zero. Yes? Yeah. It's actually Coca-Cola Zero. The, the symbol on the can says Coca-Cola and then Zero underneath. Smaller. Not a whole lot of people remember it being called Coca-Cola Zero, which in my opinion, I don't really remember. I remember. I just feel like it's like Coke Zero. Yeah, because it's like big, bold letters. Yeah. 
I, I kind of remember that, but I also feel like it's kind of hard to say because people might have just called it Coke Zero, which like confused the judgment. So that one I'm not super sold on. Gandhi. Everybody knows Gandhi. Yeah. Spell that. <laughs> and like, it's okay, I can say this wrong, and we're just like, no, it's the other way around! Yeah, yeah. Uh, Gandhi. G-A-N-D-I. Okay. Am I right or wrong? Neither. So everybody remembers being G-H-A-N-D-I. Uh, Gandhi. H everybody remembers that. It's actually spelled G-A-N-D-H-Y, which is like Gandhi, no. which so a they... lot of people were really outraged about. Honestly, I don't really know. I personally... Always thought it was spelled G H A N D I, but again, that could just be ignorance. Like I literally, I don't, I didn't spell it. I was, I was going straight Gandhi. Yeah, you went for the simple again. Gandhi. Imagine if I told you Gandhi was still alive. Like, would you die? <laughs> okay, next one. Is that real? No. Okay. Adult <laughs> diapers. Okay. The brand. Do you know what I'm talking about? Is it like Pope's or? <laughs> you don't know what I'm talking about. The adult diaper brand. It's been a while since I got my adult diapers. <laughs> yeah. I bought some yesterday. So. Yeah. Depends. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. I know that. Yeah. So I've never, I've literally Depends. never even seen Depends in a store, not gonna lie. But they're actually called Depend. Depend. Not Depends. Depends. Which, <laughs> I'm not really hey. sure. Like I said, I've never really seen them. It's also, it's hard when it's stuff like just like pluralization because if somebody says, oh, I bought my grandpa depends they're not they make sense because you didn't buy just wine you bought like a pack of them so I yeah I like tum and tums but tums is tums right you don't buy a pack of a tum. tum is that what a single tum I don't know so tum. fruit loops yeah fruit loops spelled f r o o t k so L -O -O -B -S. that is the fruit quote unquote loops. new way a lot of people remember being just spelled fruit U-I-T, the way you spell fruit. Yeah. And only the two O's in loops were actual Fruit Loops to do it, but it's actually two Fruit Loops For both. in each, which, um, again, that one I don't really remember. I feel like it does look like the logo changed. I swear I remember it only being two. Yeah. But they might have just changed and added the two Fruit Loops, but it's always been spelled fruit. Next one is another movie line from the movie Jaws. Get out of the water. <laughs> <laughs> Have you ever seen Jaws? Yeah. I don't remember the exact a really famous line. Oh, the no. shark is coming towards him. He looks at know. the girl and says, we're going to need a bigger boat. Oh, okay. It's sure. like, That's again, another super famous line that you can find on like mugs and shirts and all that stuff. He actually says... <laughs> we're going to need a bigger boat? Yeah. Okay. He actually says, you're going to need a bigger boat, which doesn't really make sense because they're literally both standing on the boat when the shark is coming at them so it makes sense to say we're gonna need a bigger boat yeah but he says you're gonna need a bigger boat as in like that just makes no sense like it yeah. just literally does like, not make sense it was a poor <laughs> he's just thing. saying i'm leaving yeah i'm gonna die now so you take the boat or like get off my boat and go get your own bigger yeah boat. next one is in depth okay so there's like story behind it so the mona lisa okay is famous for not smiling correct correct she has like a pretty like super symmetrical face super like chill looking mouth just she's like not Jen. smiling she's not like frowning <laughs> compliment so famous for that okay backstory and by backstory i mean let's get jen started there is an episode of wizards of waverly place alex played by selena gomez anyway she takes her friend's necklace and using her like wizard magic puts it on the Mona Lisa and then the Mona Lisa is smiling like mouth closed smile but still she has like a little smirk and then she gets in trouble by her brother Justin because he says the Mona Lisa is smiling you ruined an iconic picture by making the Mona Lisa smile right so okay. they're reinforcing the fact that she doesn't smile totally or if you look at a picture of the Mona Lisa now now or i guess forever is what the whole yeah. theory is but if you look at a picture of the mona lisa she has a little smirk and what people have done if they've taken the picture from wizards of waverly place that was like oh my god she's smiling now and put it next to what the mona lisa actually looks like and it's literally the same face 
So the theory is that the Mona Lisa now has a little bit of a smile, which is backed up by Wizards of Waverly Place because her changed face is what it is now, mm. which is crazy because if you look at a picture of her, she's like straight up smiling. Weird. Which is one of the kind of newer ones. And a lot of people are um, foreshadowing, I suppose, that that episode of Wizards of Waverly Place yeah. is going to also change eventually to make up for the fact that it's like literally TV proof. Yeah. And when you're sick, you rub Vicks on your face. Vapor Vicks. rub. Vapor rub, right? Because yeah. it's like minty. It's actually Vapo rub. There's no um, U R. Vapo rub. Vapo rub. Yeah, I feel like I used that a lot as a kid Vapor when rub. I was sick, a lot as a kid, and I Green. straight up remember it being vapor. It's blue. Is that another Mandela effect? No. <laughs> Isn't that really like teal? It's like blue. Bell barbecue. Just like a fluff. Uh, Jen, I'm not gonna spell it. B A R. Mm -hmm. B E. Q. Yeah. So everybody remembers it being um, barbecue. Q U E because Q, yeah. B B Q is how you shorten barbecue. Right? Yeah. B -B -Q. Barbecue. So everybody spelled it Q U E, which again. BBQ, that makes a million times more sense. It's actually spelled B A R B E C U E. Barbecue, again, if you put it into a Word document, it comes up with a little red squiggle, not a word. So the, the real way to do it is not real. What, or if you if put it, it C U E, that's a word, but Q U E is not a word. But to me, that one doesn't make sense because literally the shortened version of barbecue is BBQ, but there's no Q in the word. Yeah, which is not, that's not how you do it. School, they tell you to read a book. You have a test the next day, you didn't read the book. You go online and you look at the? Uh, Cliff's Notes. Cliff's Notes. Cliff's okay, so Notes. So everybody, again, everybody remembers it being Cliff Notes, mm. but it's actually called Cliff's Notes, which again, that one obviously you don't believe in. Honestly, or I never use. I just use them a lot. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, I, I never use them. So this is another one that I can't really give an opinion on because I, I didn't use them. Quit on me, Jen. Uh, on my mind again. It's a Disney movie where there's monsters. Monsters Inc. Okay, so it's Monsters Inc. Uh, and C period. That's it. So that's what everybody remembers because that's what it is. It's actually Monsters comma Inc. Which is another one that's stupid. Why they putting stuff in there? It's literally Monsters Incorporated. Yeah. And you don't put. A comma. This is so monsters. stupid. Like Incorporated. monsters. <gasps> Incorporate. <laughs> okay, Tony the Tiger. Tony the Tiger. Yellow. I mean orange. <laughs> he's orange. He's a tiger. He has a black yeah. nose because he's a tiger. Yeah. Because tigers have black noses. Yeah. It's blue. No. Yeah. That's another one that again is just a super big outrage because he's a tiger. Why the Rick, does he have a blue nose? Does he have a tail? Yeah. Okay, good. Yeah. <laughs> this is the last one, okay. but it's a doozy. A Monroe piercing is where? <laughs> Maybe you don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I know this? Why am I, I'm tripping out. I feel like my brain's telling me to do one thing. Well, and do it's... what you, yeah, yeah, okay. So the male Monroe piercing, or Monroe piercing is right above your lip on either side, it doesn't matter. The reason they call it that is because Marilyn Monroe has a mole on her face right there, right above her lip. So they named the piercing after her right. to give like yeah, credit, credit to her. Over. Amy Winehouse has a Monroe piercing in honor of Marilyn Monroe. Okay. She was, like, she yeah, was, like, so there's I a lot of credit given from the piercing. So much credit to her. from the piercing. Her mole is actually like over here. So the a whole accreditation from the piercing it has nothing to do with it. Nothing to do. I feel like I need to go take a nap well, and you like can. contemplate my life. You can take a nap. And if you guys have any other ones that are yeah, that you let know me of, know because I'm literally obsessed with this. I spent like three hours the other day watching them, 
I feel like I was really tame in this video because I'm trying not to like have a bunch of people think I'm a psychopath who yeah. needs to wear like a tinfoil hat. Which wasn't too far off what we were going to do. <laughs> <laughs> Let me know what you think too. If there's yeah. any of these that like really blew your mind, let me know. If there's yeah. any that I didn't mention that really blew your mind, also let me know. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, like we said, leave a comment down below. Leave a like if you did enjoy the video. Make sure you follow me on Instagram and Snapchat at SmileySox22. Follow Jason as well, Team Casual Universe. I will put that in the description spelled properly. Don't you worry. And. <laughs> Subscribe to become You'll get part that joke of the if you go to my channel and watch yeah, the video. Yeah, yeah. Subscribe to become a part of the family, and I will see you guys next time. Bye. And I feel like probably people have it tattooed on their body like this. Totally, exactly. <laughs> and then it's so wrong.